we have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what, 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found nothing. Enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need some meat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, at this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. All right, let's head out. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay, apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. This is good. Come on, let's try this way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. Huh. Mm. The wind's died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. No, shh. Stay quiet. Ha! Whoa! Hey, stop here a second. I see something. Uh, careful. Has deer been here recently? How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it from here. Quiet as you can. Stay low and move slowly. There they are. Quick, get that bow out, Arthur. Focus, Arthur. We need a good shot. Now let's try for another. Don't use your 
your knife on her. It'll be the quickest. Done. Okay, that'll do it. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Ah, older. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. When you are. Nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Ah. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go. He's weak, but... That makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with your Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. Uh, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. What are you doing? Look out! Sure. That saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. Easy. Whoa! How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him.
I'm gonna hitch tie him over here. Brought some food back, boys! Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Oh, and, uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well! Bring it over, then! What a surprise to find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Go get to skin you. <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one that you dumped on the floor there. Too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town if you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah. <coughs> Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. 